Hello YouTube, it's DTA Show, DTA Pokemon Blue Let's Play, part 41. In the last part, YouTube, we started searching the ghost tower and now we can continue searching it. I've lost my pen. I had two pens. Oh, there it is. Oh. Yeah, we, we, we've had like half an hour break to charge the battery up again and I've lost my fucking pen! <laughs> Adam, can't you keep an eye on two pens? No! <laughs> They're right in front of me and I'll probably lose them. <laughs> anyway, where were we? We're scaling the ghost tower. This place is filled with gases and um, shit. And that's pretty much it really. Are this, uh, uh, so the, ha the haunters and cubones are too rare to really rely on finding. Um, Nightshade, it does uh, the same amount of damage with your health is. It's the same as Seismic Toss. In that respect. Really? Yeah. Um. You are a prick. <laughs> Crush, do what your name implies. It killed you, mate. It killed you, Pikachu. Yeah, well, she's just been bubbled to death. She? Oh, yeah, right. <laughs> you gonna go back and heal? Nah, I've always started the part. I'll, I'll heal if I need to do later on. Yeah, in this tower you'll find you'll find these women. They're sort of mediums that become I don't know, possessed. I, I, you I, shall join us. I found uncles there. They're sort of um. Uh, Not even sure if they're women actually. Yeah, I can't even tell if what they are either. This is almost as bad as Final Fantasy with the um character design. Seriously, what is it with Final Fantasy of making girls look like men and men look like girls? Fucking Squaresoft! Yeah, take the take, take the classic Final Fantasy VII. Your main character is a blonde ponce with spiky, Adam, weird girl hair. Yeah. Yeah, don't call Cloud Striper ponce. We'll get fanboys after us. Bring it on! <laughs> he's got a, he's a spiky head prick. And who's who's the main heroine? Tifa Lockhart, biggest badass bitch you'll ever you ever fight against. She's more butch than the main character! <laughs> what does butch mean? Look it up. Does it mean, um, her, but, bo her body's been butchered or something like that? No, that would be someone gruesome. Does it mean she'd be under the knife to make her Very body? manly, should oh. I say. Well, she's a mo Ser ser Seriously, if you her, get, um, get her drunk in the morning, she'll have stubble. Um, Who's that fucking hardcore? Tifa, she's... Her job class is Monk, which is a, which is a bare faced fighter. So you don't get much more manly than punches someone in the face and saying, I am a man! But she isn't. But even if she even if she said that, it would probably fit. Anyway, moving on. Moving, move, trying to move desperately away from the, uh, the androgynous sprites from Final Fantasy. Yeah. <laughs> Square off. In your next Final Fantasy game, please try and steer clean of, of um, transvestites. You know, m have people that look like genders. Just a request there. Dude, throw some transvestites in there. It might make the storyline bearable. Seriously, you can't get much more bland than 13. And from, and from what I hear, 14 was a huge letdown. 14 wasn't even finished when they released it. That's the major problem. That's the thing with the online role-playing games, MMOs. They're always being updated. So, basically, when it's released, what you buy isn't the finished product. You found the ghastly. Yeah, this point here heals your Pokemon perfectly. Really? Oh, does that wake uh, what's his toss up as well? Yep. Come, child, I seal this place with my white magic. You can rest here. We've encountered a white mage in a Pokemon game! <laughs> Check her sleeves, does she have those little red triangles? I can't, it's a Game Boy! It's black oh. and white graphics, you. You. person who can't notice things for, um. shit, moron. You know, it's black and white! <laughs> I'm sure there's a word for that, a person who can't notice for shit, moron. But, uh. 
<laughs> you you visually challenged Morlorn. Visually challenged. There you go. Visual is your. Is I know what you mean, mate. You know, I'm not that dense. You can, I, do, I, I do understand what you're saying. Die. Pikachu! I've not gone for optical challenge myself. But Pikachu, yeah. you have been taught well in the ways of die. Here's your ways of die diploma. The martial art way of die. <laughs> yeah. Ooh, a nugget! You nugget! <laughs> we'll start later on YouTube and get more money for it. No, it's itself about 5,000, is it? Yeah, but it's worth it. Why is she attacking you with the Dreamcatcher? I have no idea! She's a horde and I want to kill it, that's all I care about! Time to use Pikachu's signature move from the Pokemon series, Thunderbolt! That's one thing I wanted to ask you. Yeah. You know in the in the game, Yeah. your Pokemon can only learn four moves. Yeah. If it wants to learn another move, it has to forget a move that it currently has. Yes. Does that happen in the anime? No, they just seem to use any move they feel like. Yeah, I noticed that! I don't... Adam, what time are we on? Oh, we're on 6.15. Okay. It, it, if, so in, if, if the anime is supposed to be based on the <laughs> based on the game... Yeah, but I think um, the anime is allowed a little bit of creative um, artistic license. Yeah, I suppose so. I mean, for Christ's sake, we have pi every season Pikachu seems to be leveled down to, to a cat piece sort of age. Yeah, that that's what, that's nothing that, bug, nothing that bugged me. At this point, Ash has pe put... Pikachu must be like level 100 and can probably wipe out humanity just by coughing in the wrong direction. Yeah. It's it's said in the anime that his Pikachu is the strongest Pikachu in existence. Well, and the, the, Meowth the, seems to have that sort of infatuation with it. Yeah, I don't know I don't know why. And that thing must be able to take on pretty much anything well, at in, this point. In season 1, that thing Almost in there, having beat a Dragonite, and Dragonite doesn't go down easy. Um, I, and I, I must admit, they can't really implement a leveling system and experience uh, into a, well, an anime. They actually, they actually do try and implement it. They say your Pikachu must be a high level, that Rhyhorn must be a high level. You know, they yeah. do, they do try and mention it, but they don't. And they, and Ash does training montages for his gym battles, so they do try and implement it, but. It doesn't really come off as as much number crunch as actually in the computer games. Yeah, in the anime, everything seems to be on, be more organic. Uh, you know, the, the Pokemon don't don't evolve and don't don't evolve by reaching a certain level. They just it's like it's like growing up. It takes time and shit like that. But uh, I don't know. It just it just. Just some of the uh, something that bugged me, and in the game you can only use Sometimes four moves. Sometimes evolution sort of occurs occurs on friendship as well, or like when Charmander evolves into, I mean, like when Charmeleon evolves into Charizard, it gets pissed off at Aerodactyl and evolves into Charizard just so it can fight the bleeding thing. Naturally, because because naturally Charmander Charmeleon does that have wings, so it gets pissed off and wants to kill the thing. Yeah, I know. I tried to use head, but that's my fault. Yeah, why? Confusion. I wanted to nuts a ghost! You wanted to nuts one that don't technically exist. I don't think ghosts do exist. Because, as far as I'm concerned, if you can see something, it, it almost exists. Ghosts do exist. I've seen stuff in my life. I have quite a familiarity with the um, ghost world. I suppose everyone's got their ghost stories. I've got a couple. But, frank frankly, I was a kid then, so I honestly don't don't think I don't just think it was real. Just because you're a kid doesn't mean ghosts don't exist. Yeah, maybe just because you're a kid, you can, you know, you a Cubone. You're gonna try catching it? Yeah, pause camera. I'm gonna try catching this thing. You can do it on camera, can't you? Swift. One hit kill. No. Why am I catching this just the hell? Because it's a Q bug. And know, it's we, rare. We spent several parts talking about the bugger. I think, <laughs> we, I think it deserves our recognition. Q bug, the fabled possible son of Kangaskhan. Bullshit. 
I said, we yeah. already debunked that theory like, uh, last session. I got a comment from Footloose 2005. He said, Dude, use 10 Pokemon and do a biology lesson. Lol. Well, it is a simple fact that a Kangaskhan skull looks nothing like a Cubone. I know. Yay. Call it missing, Neil, just to piss everyone off. Nah. <laughs> No, call it Kangaskhan. Nah. Cubone, lonely. Because it never removes its helmet, its skull helmet, no one has ever seen the Pokemon's real face. I'll nickname it later if I plan on using it. There's a nickname person for that reason. Hey, come on! <laughs> yeah, oh, 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 it is so on now, woman. You know, I can't even really use my Pokemon. Waiting until you've been... <laughs> Uh, worn down by the random battle, then attack. I like I like this woman's uh, style. It's war now. Yeah, whatever. You can lift me all you want. Uh, dude. <laughs> dude. Oh damn! Dude! Imagery, <laughs> not good. Dude. I'm referring to the Pokemon attack! Dude. I didn't pause because I want to go back down to that fallen heel. The nightmares will ensue! Right, off we go. Oh yeah, you two, we apologise for Adam's definition of the word lick me. Dude. Seriously, you... Why did you say that? I didn't mean it in that way. I, I, Lick is one of the weakest attacks in the game, that's why I tried to make it sound as unthreatening as possible, but Adam made it you worse. You could have really worded that a lot better. I was counting on this, Adam. We're on 12.05. Right, we're almost at the top of the tower, we're almost on the um, Marowak. Do you want to talk about your way of beating Marowak with the Poké Doll? Because we're almost there. Yeah. At the top of this tower, there's a a, a a kind of boss. It's a Marowak. It's level 30, so you, it's, I suppose it could be challenging. It's labelled as the only Pokemon that can't be caught with a Great Ball. Or any uh, ball Sorry, a Master Ball. Seriously, you could hack a Master Ball into it and you cannot catch this thing. But you can kill it. Or, if you want my opinion, just throw a Poké Doll at it, it buggers off because it's classed as a random battle, and you just carry on. Well, first I prefer to kill him for experience points. I'm going to put a um, crutch in here, because it'll kill it easily. We're not there yet. you got no more room for items. Alright, what can we get rid of? Adam, pause cam, I need to back to the puggles there, because I can't get the items here. Do you, don't you still have a HP up? Yeah. Right, use that. Who's got those health? Uh, Duracell, 68. Right. So what's this thing? A rare candy. Well, you can use that as well. I'm in Pokemon, I need to check my experience points. I'm going to get to Boat on YouTube, because he needs it more, I want to learn Razor as soon as possible. Right, moving on. Just... You need to sort your stuff out now. Right then. Be gone, intruders. And here she is. That is the that is the sprite you'll get if you don't have the self scope. Self scope unveiled the ghost's identity. This is Marowak, a, a very good ground type Pokemon. Unfortunately, you can't capture this one yet. But later on in the game, you will be able to, and this is a very good Pokemon. Definitely will recommend it, although you, this is one of the latest ground types in the game. We're on 1420, by the way. Anyway, you two, in the next part, we shall defeat Marowak.